You are listening to the Bad Boy Radio Show with Mr. Locario and Miles Cunningham. This is that real shit, not that fake shit. The only radio show that's not afraid to tell you the truth about the game. This is the Bad Boy Radio Show. Remember, the truth is inside you. Merry Christmas. Right. You know, happy New Year. Exactly. Uh, look out for that. Look out for the Mr. Locario sale. For the, exactly. You know, exactly. We get we, we, we go we going in this 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 one. We, you're gonna get a lot of shit this time. So I'm telling you, you guys gonna want to make sure you take advantage of this uh you know this holiday sale to get on the Bad Boy membership. Because we're going to give you guys a lot of stuff. And the new Bad Boy membership program I got coming out, uh, you know, um, at the beginning of January. Or I, I might drop it December 31st. Um, it's going to be called The Art of Approaching Groups of Women. So I'm talking about how to really get that girl who's in that group. You know, when you go out and you see the chick, it'd be like for her and four of her friends. It's like, how do you get that girl? How do you get into the group? How do you talk to them? Who do you talk to? Do all this other stuff. You know, so I break it down like crazy i think this is actually one of my most technical bad boy um membership programs so you're gonna have to have like a pen and a pad for this shit you feel what i'm saying so nice, nice. So it's going in if I'm just you, you guys accept that rejection is part of the game and you right. use it as a tool to motivate you you feel what i'm saying right now see the thing is this right you know the the, the real reason that you know people are scared of rejection you know men and women or whoever is that people people they're 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 scared of not being loved they're scared of not right. being accepted there's they because right. the You're thing right. is right because the thing is you know you your ego right and we talk about the ego we're talking about your 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 sense of self you know who you are and all that your false sense of self basically is that right you want people to like you so if you go up to a chick and you holler at her and she's like, oh, I don't want to fuck with you. <clears throat> then you start thinking there's something actually wrong with you. You see what I'm saying? Right. So all see, and this is why people want to avoid the rejection, because it's like you don't want to feel like something's wrong with you, because a lot of times a lot of guys already think there's something wrong with them. Just like we was talking about earlier with those guys that be making those videos talking about I ain't shit and nobody don't like me and blah, 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 blah. Right. Right. So that rejection is confirmation to what they already feel about themselves. You see what I mean? But the thing is, is that you have to understand that rejection has to happen. You feel what I mean? It has to happen. Right. That's what, that's what people don't understand. Like, and I said this before in in another video, I was like, every girl can't like you. And, and you would, you would think that you would want every girl to like you, but you have to understand that if every girl actually liked you, like really liked you, your life would be a living hell. You understand what I'm saying? Right. You would right. be fucking, and you would go, and you'd probably die. You know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> like, exactly. Because, because th- there has to be the balance. This is why everybody can't like you. Because if every girl liked you, imagine how much attention and how much energy is going to be coming your way if every every woman liked you. You see what I'm saying? Right. You can't right. deal with that. There has to be some that are not going to want to fuck with you. Just like there's there's going to be some that are going to want to fuck with you. You understand? Your job is to find the ones who do want to fuck with you and, 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 and at the same time, not be phased by the ones who don't want to fuck with you because you have to understand that that's supposed to happen. See, once you realize it's supposed to happen, then you're going to understand that, you know, there's nothing to really worry about with the shit. That's the thing that most guys don't get. Like, you got to understand right. that the shit's going to fucking happen. You understand? Right. It even gets deeper than this where it's like, because, you know, what you got to understand is like, you don't really like, man, how deep should I, can, can I get a little deep? I don't want, you know, I want to yeah, know, yeah, just, make it, go, go in, go, this go is in. going, this is going right. You got you to gotta say <laughs> something. You don't need to be liked. Okay. You don't need to be liked. And you also don't really need to have somebody say you're awesome and, and have somebody say that they love you. You don't need none of that shit. The reason why you feel like you need that is because you've been conditioned your whole life to get approval. So when you were younger and, you know, you would dance for mommy and daddy in the living room and they clap and be like, yay, you're good and you're awesome and blah, blah, blah. So that started the fucking cycle right there. 
So now you've been right. your whole life trying to get more of that yay and hand claps. You see what I'm saying? Right. So instead of just on a practical level doing things to interact and enjoy experiences, what you're doing is – so instead of just going up to a girl and saying in, – in hollering at her to try to get with her and then either getting with her or not getting with her and being okay with that, what you're doing is that it's not even about just getting with her. You want validation. You want the hand claps. You want the praise. You want to con- constantly be reminded that you're liked and that you're loved. So when right. so when that's not happening or when it doesn't happen at a certain point or when you feel like it's not happening enough – then you start to fucking lose your goddamn mind. You start to get upset. Right. You start to feel like you're nothing. You're like, but but I thought I was something. I'm supposed to get the praise. Where's the praise at? Where's the approval? Where's all this other shit? You see what I mean? And so this is why you're right. scared of rejection because the rejection is is it, it's it's the other side of the spectrum of the praise. You feel what I'm saying? Right. But That's what, real shit. Right. That's real shit. But what you got to understand is is that. The rejection and the praise is sort of the same fucking thing, just on different sides of the spectrum. You see what I mean? Right. Because you can't get praise without rejection. Because what the fuck is praise without re- You don't even know what praise is without rejection. You need rejection for mm-hmm. praise. You need praise for rejection. You see what I'm saying? You need the, right. the you need the, the loser to understand who the winner is. But it's, right. still the, it's exactly. basically the same shit because you can't have one without the other. It's on the same spectrum. You see what I mean? Right. It's like just like when you get haters, you a, a hater is just a, 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 a shout out. Shout out to the confident hoe because she made a video the other day about this, and I was like, she spent some real shit. She said, <laughs> she said that uh, a hater is a person that that loves you but hasn't accepted that they loved you yet. You see what I'm saying? Mm. <laughs> like, yeah, that's some you real really shit. That? Yeah, I'm like, saying some real shit. Wow. I was like, that's okay. some real shit. I was like, all right. that's all that is. You see what I mean? Because when someone loves, it's they, they've accepted it. You feel what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? Right. But when they're hating, they haven't accepted that they love you because all that hate and that energy and that attention is love. You see what I'm saying? Right. Right. So it's like, you know what I mean? So it's basically on the same, it's the same thing or just on a different side of the spectrum. So the thing is, when it comes to, to fucking rejection, is that you got to understand that that's part of it. That's that's part of the whole thing. So when you get a girl who doesn't reject you, right, you have to understand that the only reason you got a girl who didn't reject you is because you had women who did reject you. You see what I'm saying? Because for you right. to even understand that when you look at it objectively, when you for you to experience that feeling of, oh, this is cool that this girl uh, you know, wanted to get with me, you had to experience the other side. Now there's there's levels to the shit. There's there's the level that you talk about, right? Right. Where it's like you have to understand that rejection is a part of it. But there's another level where you all right, I really love the part when you said that we've been conditioned to we've been conditioned to the mechanism of validation. Right. You understand? Mm. Where it's like when you when you when you when you do good on a test in school, they give you a, you know, a grade, a letter grade. And, right. you know, so when you get an A or a B, that's validation. That validates that you know the subject. And, right. you know, you, you, when, when, you, when you win a race, you get, you get validation if you're in the first place, second place, third place, whatever. Right. You know, you, when, you, when, you, when you do something and somebody says thank you, that's validation. You right. understand what I'm saying? But the, the, the real thing, like... The real, like, uh, let me see, the, the other, like, the other level, the spiritual level of this shit, mm-hmm. and the, the, the overall, like, mastery of the game level is realizing that the only, only validation you need is your own. Ooh, preach. You understand what I'm saying? So, when, when, when we start to get into, like, Actually talking to a girl and her not responding to your game or whatever and not responding to your advance or your approach. That's like- now, if you want to hear the full episode of this bad boy show, make sure you click the link below and join the Patreon because all of the new bad boy shows are going to be on Patreon. All right. So make sure you click that link below, join the Patreon so you will never miss a bad boy show episode.